Thank you, Corrine. If the special counsel says President Biden has got significant limitations on his memory, then who is helping him run the country? The President of the United States runs the country. The Commander-in-Chief runs the country. But just the little part of what we get to see, he's made mistake after mistake after mistake after mistake on camera this week. So I want to be very clear here. Um, that report, that part of the report does not live in reality. It just doesn't. So the special I, uh, um, anyway, and I don't want to, I don't want to, I'll maybe choose my words. I was just thinking, uh, uh, the, anyway, I, I just, look, I mean, Putin's kleptocracy. Uh, uh, yeah, it was in February, February uh, January, after we been elected. The so late January, early, early February. And I'm telling you, this guy's tough. He's smart. He's on his game. And as Secretary Mallorca said a minute ago, when you go in to brief the president, you got You better have your big boy pants on. <laughs> and you had just mentioned how these interviews happened shortly after the October 7th attacks. The president mentioned it last night. In mentioning that, does that mean that possible memory lapses happened because he was so distracted by what was happening overseas? Are you serious? He said, uh, it's not, we lead... Uh, not just, uh, well, I won't go into it. Here's what drives the driver uh, in the states that are affected. Here's what the, you can do, the drivers. Uh, I, uh, for two reasons. One, to, it's an impact, an impact that decades are making because inaction, uh, and what I saw of that report last night, I believe is, as a former prosecutor, um, the comments that were made by that prosecutor, gratuitous, inaccurate, and inappropriate. And the president was in front of and on top of it all. Liar! There was in actually uh, with, with with the Department of uh, uh, with from from uh, uh, Char excuse me from Charlotte one and, uh, another line going from in, in Florida down to Tampa. The best way to get something done, if you if it holds near and dear to you that you uh, um, like to be able to anyway, the idea that. Um, you think this sort of, is this putting the thumb on the scale or do you feel yeah. like it'll wash away? I mean, I think that the point of this report was to put, put the thumb on the scale. And remember, her work in the Trump administration. Yes, he did. This guy is a partisan. Right. His editorializing about Biden is completely irrelevant. And it was set up in a way to deliver right wing talking points. I didn't come away from the special counsel's failure to ask precise questions and think to myself, he has mental acuity problems. I just thought he was asking bad questions. And I see Joe every day. I see him out, you know, traveling around this country. I see his vigor. I see his energy. I see his passion. And 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 Joan, Shengang, 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 cool. But uh, there's, you know, there's to be, you know, beginning uh, this effort. Uh, and uh, and uh, I want you to know that. Uh, I want to thank you as well for uh, with the nature, not and the uh, and uh, and, uh, the, uh, and, and Aqua and as well as Shram. America is a nation that can be defined in a single word. I was gonna put him in, uh, put, put look <laughs> a solid meeting with um, with. Uh, the uh, Los Angeles and uh, and uh, um, uh, um, what am I doing here? From the uh, 
uh, uh, uh, excuse me, they can also increase corporate uh, growth. They make a very good point. Here's the deal. 159000000000 billion less. My plan is to make concrete, concrete. I know, I know President, uh, excuse me. The, um... You know, it's funny. I hear a lot of uh, people asking me about his age. And as a native person, I really have a tremendous amount of respect for elders. I think that Joe Biden's mental acuity is very, very on. He's one of the smartest, sharpest people I've met in DC. I found him very clear, uh, and very focused. We uh, uh, managed to agree on the war aims and on many things. Sometimes we had disagreements, but they weren't born of a, a lack of understanding on his part or on my part. Uh, so uh, that's what I can tell you. Uh, I guarantee it. Would I lie? Leading, leading tech companies like Anthropic, and I'm going to mispronounce. I'm not going to try. The beer brewed here, <laughs> it is used to make the brew beer in this final. Oh, Earth Rider, thanks for the Great Lakes. By the end of the governing crisis, uh, it's time to end it. these constant. Yeah. Because that's why we can't let, well, uh, we cannot let this election be one where the same man who was president four years ago. I'll never forget. Well, I won't go into that. Anyway, I, I, I just think that uh, Florida Small Business Winner Award winner, uh, Business Week winner. Now, he has the Evolver Institution. About uh, um, uh, the former prime minister, uh, like to take baths of the uh, anyway. Overruled not to uh, reinstate uh, the uh, 32nd freestanding, have free 30 free. So the way that the president's demeanor in that report was characterized could not be more wrong on the facts and clearly politically motivated.